Welcome back my YouTube friends and family or welcome if you're new here. This is Lindsay and I am back with more daily work from home job leads for you. In today's video we are packed with well-known companies like Staples, Nordstrom's, Nestle or Nespresso that is owned by Nestle. We've got Holland America Cruise Line. We've got Cirrus XM Radio, Harbor Freight Tools, a lot of big name companies hiring people to work from home and Nestle slash Nespresso is even hiring someone to literally respond to social media reviews completely non-phone, no talking, and they're paying over a thousand dollars a week. We're going to dive all into it just real quickly. If you're new here, this channel is all about bringing you the best work from home jobs daily. So I search all of the job boards daily, trying to weed out the scams so that you don't have to. And I find the best jobs and I share them with you on a daily basis, timestamps and links to a page that include all the review glass door pages, plus the job application pages. If you're interested in putting in the application are always in the YouTube description box below this video. I do just always ask that if you enjoy any of my job leads, help me out. Let me know. Give this video a thumbs up, like button, and share it with all your friends and family. But without wasting any more time, first up we have Staples. Now Staples is well known. They have 14,000 reviews on Glassdoor and overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.3 out of 5 stars. They are looking for a team manager for their customer success or customer support team. Again, remote all of these are going to be remote for the United States. Pay for this one is anywhere from $65,600 a year all the way up to $79,200 a year. Now, I always say if you've spent years working in an industry, honing your skills, and you've got like great customer service skills, why not move up the totem pole into leadership, like management supervisors, that side kind of thing. Not all management positions will require a college degree. This is the path that I'm taking myself and I do work now as a hiring manager working from home for a healthcare company. So I do work a full-time corporate work from home job aside from sharing these job leads on YouTube with you. So Staples is looking for just that though. They're looking for somebody to manage all of their customer support associates. So you're going to help with hiring, coaching them, developing, training them, teaching them how to be the best customer service associate that they can. You're going to optimize efficiencies in the process by leveraging your individual and team strengths, delegating tasks to the appropriate level and driving just consistency in the process. So you are going to conduct research and manage and manage special projects for the customer service team as needed. Now, no college degree is needed, just a high school diploma or GD and two years of customer service experience. They do want somebody who is a great problem solver, who has great organization on time management skills and someone who can multitask. Now, they do offer a standard benefit package as well. If you don't want to be managing people, though, that's completely understandable. Next up, we have Nordstrom hiring. Nordstrom has 24,000 reviews on Glassdoor, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.6 out of 5 stars. They are looking for a customer care op support specialist. Again, this is remote in the United States. But they are looking for somebody who can be adaptable with their ever-changing business needs. So you'll be need to be flexible in the shifts that you can work, including some nights, weekends, and holidays. But they're looking for somebody to act as a brand ambassador for the Nordstrom company, just providing that world-class customer support to all of their customers. So you're going to be taking inbound and making outbound phone calls, resolving any customer inquiries and questions, issues quickly and accurately, just offering effective solutions, looking for areas of improvement and communicate any feedback up to your managers. So you're going to use like problem solving skills, just helping all of the customer care specialists. They are looking for somebody who has one year of customer service experience. They do prefer two years, but they'll take one year. Somebody who has great communication skills can be a problem solver. And again, the ability to work in a fast paced environment. Now they are hiring mostly throughout the United States. There are a handful of states they cannot hire in. Those are listed right here. 
Pay for this position ranges depending on location, but can go very high. It looks like the biggest pay gap is for California, where pay can be anywhere from $18.75 an hour all the way up to $39 an hour. If you're here, though, for that non-phone support, reviewing the social media reviews and handling all of that, this one might be for you. The company Nespresso, we have all heard of them. They have like Nespresso pod machines, almost like Keurig machines that they sell with little Nespresso pods that you can buy. They are actually owned by Nestle, the food company. They have 2,500 reviews on Glassdoor, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.8 out of 5 stars. They are looking for a senior customer service representative. This is for all of their digital channels, but you're going to be doing a lot of those reviews left on social media channels. Again, remote for the United States. Real quickly, just for anyone's knowledge, if you didn't know, Nestle, the food company, owns Nespresso, Purina Pet Food, and other brands as well. But this one is specifically working for their Nespresso brand. They're looking for somebody to do customer service and manage those social media reviews for all of their digital channels. So non-phone, so website, live chat, email, online ratings and reviews. So you're going to be the subject matter expert across all of their digital platforms, including Yelp reviews, trade reviews and ratings, um, ratings and reviews like on Amazon. You'll also handle the website, live chat and emails. You're going to have to have a knowledge and understanding of the core brand principles, products and services, including customer services, policies and procedures. You're gonna write engaging personalized content on a daily basis, just responding to all of these social media reviews and any questions that come in through email or live chat. So you're going to flag any hot topic or sensitive topics and send them to management for immediate guidance and resolution. You're just really trying to engage and evaluate the validity of the reviews and ratings that are given on social media channels like Yelp and things like that. Just trying to keep the brand in a positive light, trying to keep negative reviews to a minimum. If you do see negative reviews, you're trying to help the customer and basically change their mind, give them a positive experience. They are only looking for somebody who has a high school diploma or GD while they prefer a bachelor degree. It's not required as long as you have two years of experience in managing ratings, reviews for social media like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Yelp, Amazon, those types of things. You've got to know how to work a computer, specifically those Microsoft Office systems have great customer service skills, great communication skills, and the ability to manage multiple chats or multiple things at the same time. Pay for this position is anywhere from $45,000 a year all the way up to $55,000 a year. That $55,000 mark is a little over $1,000 a week. More of like the data entry type jobs. Next up, we have UofL Health. They have 383 reviews on Glassdoor, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.4 out of 5 stars. They are hiring a remote charge entry specialist. Now, this is going to be in the healthcare field. It is an entry level position where you're going to be basically entering charges for multiple specialties and physician groups into their computer systems. They use Centricity and all scripts. So you're going to enter these charges from both paper tickets or all scripts and digital tickets. You're going to maintain strict attention to detail, making sure you enter all charges accurately. So you'll review these charges while entering the basic facts needed, providing feedback to management and coding on any errors or missing information that you find. You're going to perform a demographic entry with insurance verification as needed. So Demographics are like patient's name, address, insurance information, things like that into the system. You're just going to resolve any issues for demographics and insurance that's missing. You will have to meet productivity goals. Now, one thing about this, they only require high school diploma or GD, and they prefer prior experience with data entry. That's really all that they say as far as what is actually needed. Now, to get you to the top of the line, they have some preferences. They need somebody who's a positive attitude, who can adhere to HIPAA guidelines, who has great communication skills, and can be dependable. Sadly, I don't work for any of these companies. I'm simply sharing what I find online. Pay was not listed for this position in the job description. That'll need to be discussed with them at the time of the interview. 
But if you're a person who likes cruises and likes to travel, so you want to work a job from home, make some money, and maybe even get some discounts on some cruises so you can travel more often with your friends and family, maybe working for an actual cruise line might just be for you. The company Holland America, they are owned, I do believe, by parent company Carnival. They have 819 reviews from past and current employees, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.6 out of 5 stars. They are looking for a personal cruise consultant. This is remote for the United States. They do include a sign-on bonus. They are looking, this is more going to be like a sales role. So you're going to get a standard pay, plus you're going to be eligible for like commissions and things for cruises and upsells that you book. But basically, they're looking for somebody who has strong sales skills and time management who can multitask and use, be a master of like using a computer systems to basically make outbound sales calls to guests who have already expressed interest in Holland America's cruises. So maybe they've been on the website, they've been looking for cruises and there's like a little box that says request more information and they enter in their contact details. So this is not completely cold calling people who are not interested in taking cruises. They've already given Holland America their information and expressed they're interested in taking a cruise and booking a cruise. Your job is going to be calling them, letting them know what cruises are offered, what package deals, what kind of deals you can make for them, things like that, and basically trying to persuade them or talk them into going ahead and booking their cruise. Now they are gonna offer a 10 to 12 week paid training for these cruises because your job is basically a salesperson. You're gonna sell cruises. The department hours are Monday through Friday, 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Saturday, Sunday, 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So you're going to have to work some weekends. But as far as a pay goes, they are making sure you get a minimum base wage of at least $15 an hour. Now they have all of their pay and benefits broken down, but you'll never make less than $15 an hour or higher based on the minimum wage guidelines set for your location. So you don't have to worry about that if you're not good at making sales. Now during the training period, they are gonna pay you for training and they say you're going to make approximately $3,200 a month for that training period. And then your base pay plus your performance and commissions on the typical performers, they say pay is typically anywhere from $50,000 a year to like $80,000 a year. Training class begins on April 22nd of 2024. If you're not interested in selling things, that is okay. Next up, we have Cirrus XM. They have two different positions open. Cirrus XM is, we all know, the radio thing that you can have in your car. They have 1,200 reviews on Glassdoor, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.5 out of 5 stars. Their first position they have is a call center response specialist. The next position they have is a call center retention specialist. So one is going to be more of responding to any of the customer's concerns, issues, things like that, like a regular customer service rep. The other, the retention specialist, you're trying to keep people from canceling their membership to the subscription. You are trying to keep them a loyal customer. So both are going to be customer service like phone jobs, but one is just a little bit more persuading people not to cancel their service where one is just answering general questions. Real quickly before we dive into the specifics of these jobs though, I do want to point out because it doesn't really specifically say remote in big bold letters where it's apparent in these job descriptions. If you go up to the top of this page where it says careers and you click careers home, you open their main careers page. When you type remote in the search keyword bo box and hit find jobs, a list of all of their remote jobs will come up. If you scroll down to like where it says call center response specialist, right under where it says location, it'll tell you where the home location is, Irving, Texas, but then it also says remote. So that's how one thing I got that both of these are remote. And then in this call center response specialist, if you scroll all the way down to like what you need, like requirements where they normally list, like if you need a high school diploma, it does also say you need a dedicated home workspace. So I did want to point that out. So I don't have any questions in the comments, just trying to be clear as I can be. 
But first up for the call center response specialist, you're basically going to be utilizing communication, knowledge, retention, and recall, speed and efficiency, creative problem solving, all of those types of things, emotional stability and empathy for the customer, just helping approach service and retention with compassion and perseverance, building rapport with the customer, just active listening and educating them on how to use products, services, answering any questions they have. You're gonna have multiple computer systems and various tools that you need to do this with and you're going to have to stay within a call quality adherence and guidelines one to two years of customer service experience in a high school diploma or GD. They do want somebody who can drive a customer's retention through your responses. You've got to be fluent in English, English, excuse me, great attention to detail and be flexible in the times that you can work. And with the call center retention specialist, it's almost going to be the exact same thing. But with this one, you're going to utilize some sales skills, asking probing questions and providing benefit statements with the customer. You're going to try to persuade them that they don't need to cancel. You're keeping them as a customer because these are the benefits of the product that they really need. So you're just going to, again, connect and build rapport and loyalty with that customer. They want somebody who has six months of relevance sales experience with this one, someone who has experience in a customer service or contact center and a high school diploma or GD. Again, fluent in English, great attention to detail and the ability to multitask. And last but not least, we have Harbor Freight Tools hiring. They have 3,000 reviews on Glassdoor, an overall employee satisfaction rating of 3.7 out of 5 stars. They are hiring an associate merchant for remote work from home. Now, this one is going to require a bachelor degree. Real quickly, if you're still hanging tight with me, I share mostly jobs that only require a high school diploma or GD, but it's been a long time since I've done a poll on my channel and I have new viewers so please leave it down in the comments if you have any kind of a degree whether it's associates or bachelors please let me know just say yes I have a degree or no I'm not don't let me know how many of you actually hold a bachelor degree if I need to be sharing more jobs that require degrees they do pay more sometimes but back to this one Harbor Freight is looking for somebody to basically analyze research and support their retail assortment and category reviews. You'll coordinate promotional plans that are gonna help drive their profit average basket and increase their sales. So you'll be responsible for like executing promotional plans through like direct mail, digital, social media, in-store marketing. So you might have to come up with like a social media campaign to run on Facebook, something like that. You're just going to collaborate with product development brands, packaging teams, just helping with the inventory department for sales and promotional planning. So they are looking for somebody who has a bachelor degree and two, year of, two years of experience in product merchandising, product management, or even retail related experience. You've got to be able to use a computer, specifically those Microsoft Office system, great communication skills. And this one does pay very well. Pay on the low end is $81,100 a year. On the high end, it's $122,800 a year. All right, if you've made it to the end of this video, I owe you a huge thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much for watching and supporting me. Feel free to leave in the comments anything specific that you're looking for. I do read those and keep that in mind. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like button if you enjoyed any of it. Share with all your friends and family. And of course, I'll be back really, really soon with more work from home job leads just for you.